In this video, I'm going to quickly show you how to install and register your software. So after you've downloaded it, so after you purchased uh, through our purchase process, or I'm not sure which one we've used at the time of recording this video, but whichever way you purchased or have acquired our software, um, you would have been given a download link. So it's either in a members area or another page of, or maybe in, through an email. You'll get the link and after you download it, the software will be contained within a zip file. So it will be named t-inspector-setup.zip. And now what you have to do is after you get it on your computer, you simply got to extract out the contents of it. The way to do that on, on Windows, a Windows computer is very simple. You can just right click and extract all and then just click extract and it will create a folder that's named the same as the zip file and inside that folder will contain the setup file and to set up the software you simply just double click the software actually there's, there's a better way to do that I always forget to mention this but um, instead of double clicking tr always try to right click and select run as administrator um, sometimes you may have limitations within your operating system that some uh, warnings may pop up or something like that. To avoid those warnings popping up, you could just run as administrator. Most of the time you don't have to, but just in case, it's sort of sort of common practice to do that. So once you've done that, just click next, 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 and next. And it should install. It will install a icon on your desktop as well. Click finish, and it should automatically just start. And so when you first install it, this is what you're going to see. You're going to see this little registration window here and you have to enter in the email that you used when you purchased our software. So um, if you if we ended up using something like JVZoo, um, you'll have to enter in your PayPal email because uh, we'll be using PayPal through there. So, if, sorry, excuse me. All you have to do is enter in your PayPal email the, into this email address because um, our system gets your email after you've purchased and it's entered into our system and in order for you to activate or register the software, you have to use that same email. So you go in and use your email. I'll just use one of mine here. Of course, you can't just go ahead and use my email because you, it, it's uh, limited only to my computer. And so you're allowed to register the software on a maximum of three computers. And if you want to uh, get more, then you'd have to contact our support and we can, uh, we can figure something out for you. No problem. We can add more accommodate in any way that you need. So go ahead and click register and it'll say okay you've registered and we're done. And you shouldn't have to register ever again. Even with new versions you shouldn't have to. But if you if it does then you just simply enter in your email and it should be good to go. And that's everything. That's basically all you do to get uh, get it installed. It's pretty simple.